Hello everybody, welcome to the NAF Rules Cup first round. It's a 32 player knockout tournament and what a first round we have. We have triple skull of tabletop Denmark team fame with Undead playing his first game of Undead on Blood Bowl 3 and putting a goo on the LOS. <laughs> Up against Chaos Cop with a very standard um, necromantic team. Um, it's wonderfully named as well, it's called like NAF necromantic extra skill <laughs> uh, sorry extra money so it's brilliantly named and he's got extra money yeah so he's got exactly the absolute standard right three blocks four guards um triple score's gone for the extra skill which limits you to three guards and then the tackle is standard a block ghoul is standard a wrestle ghoul is standard but then also gone for a sneaky git ghoul which i actually i quite like that what do you think dimmy uh yeah I don't mind it it's um it's it's a cool little build I like personally I just like having block goals because I think they're fantastic but uh, like the guard mummies in this specific matchup are actually quite quite handy like uh, the there's certain matchups the guards mummies are just better in and I think this is one of them to be honest yeah if if they can stay on the pitch that's the problem isn't it like if they get clawed off yeah it's bad times for them whether they've got guard or not but yeah. You, Hopefully you can keep them together and uh, and not Pick die. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's weird. It's like a lot of eggs in one basket, and if they, they can get isolated versus the agility teams, or they can get banged out versus the bash teams, it's tough, isn't it? It is tough to like. Obviously, mummies are incredible. <laughs> you know, strength five and mighty blow, but you do want them to like not die and stuff, don't you? So it's they're a tricky. They're a tricky piece. Like you, you basically your entire success hinges on the mummies, doesn't it? I don't like. Oh, it's brave. Yeah, I don't like committing to the dodge out here. Oh my god, he blocked the square. He was dodging out too oh as well, and then god. re rolled it. Oh my <laughs> god! Has he got any re rolls left? <laughs> oh my god! Has he got any re rolls left? Yeah, he's got two. Oh right, yeah. So he he used one and then didn't use the other. Yeah, that was wild. What was the dodge roll on the first dodge? Because if you just hit him directly back, he would have made the dodge out, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, a foul appearance. In comes the reroll. Roll. Yeah. I like punching mace. With Mighty Blow. I mean, so do I, yeah. Three dicing with Mighty Blow, but... Also, I don't like losing my blitz. <laughs> so it's, uh... It's interesting. Oh, here we go. Here's the foul. Yeah, okay. The fact that it's getting you the sneaky git foul as well really uh, really adds to it, doesn't it? Yeah. Wolf. But um, Did the sneaky git save him then? That was a double three, wasn't it? Oh, was it? Yeah, it did save him. Yeah. Sneaky git, OP. Okay. Up hill. Him. <laughs> Into a water. Oh, yeah. Into a knockdown. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> it was man. Oh man. Scoring threat established, turn two. Let's go. Yep. Wild. Oh wow, the wolves. Yeah, he's got to tuck in. Um, I mean, yes, Rubinho, but the idea is that you've uh, you've broken the magical bond permanently between the necromancer and the uh, and the player, or you've just killed a ghoul, right? Because they're not actually uh, they're not actually like undead; they're alive. Ooh. Really going after these wraiths? Yeah, you got to, aren't you? I guess. Refuses to die. Oh, that's the dodge. Blitz the goal. Blitz the mummy now, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Blitz the mummy here looks really good. Whack in three guards. Could have even done the chain into the stand firm, yeah. Yeah, we can st he still can. Okay, he's not. But he still could have done from there, right? Like the fleshy goes in there, fleshy there or there, Wraith there or there, and this guy comes back and then 2Ds into 2Ds with block and claw and then you move the ball up there with, with another ghoul, so this is a great move to to go for this mummy, but uh, doesn't. 
Oh, can just go straight through the middle now, though. Look, oh, she's going for the score. <laughs> Let's go. No, no, he's oh, stalling. No. He's going for the corner. Okay, and then base and the mummy. Yeah. Crowley. Yeah, not what I'd have done. Makes the foul appearance. It really bugs me that it makes the foul appearance noise every time you blitz it, instead of just when foul appearance pops. Yeah. Yeah, me, me too. I, I agree. Yeah, like it'd be much better for me if it just made the fart noise when it works. <laughs> yes. Cause I, cause I get really excited, and then it's like... <laughs> Oh, 33 enough games. Mm. Last one in 2020. In 2020? Oh, then we're in 2020. What am I about? <laughs> we're in 2020. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, rule set, rule set. Right? <laughs> I mean, I hate to break it to you, Timmy. <laughs> but you're four years out. <laughs> <laughs> hey. And he scores. Yeah. His team name is incredible, isn't it? Naf Cup, Necros plus money. That's that's. <coughs> I love that. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah. Also bangs it in early. If it's, uh, I absolutely hate this matchup for Undead. Yeah, it's it's annoying, isn't it? Because they can claw it. Yeah. Like, it, it, it it's like it's the kind of standard Necro thing, right? Like the players, they've got four players that are super annoying, but if. You know that they're super annoying by being the guys you want to hit. So if you get to hit them, you can remove them, and then, and then it's bad times. And they, you know, the wolves can dominate, but they don't always. They're they're a weird swingy team. Um, oh, why are we not free dicing? Or are we free dicing? Uh, we might be free dicing. Well, no, he's busted the guards, but he's not going. Yeah, he, can put, he can put a zombie in, can't he? Yeah. No. I mean, he can. He can do safe moves. Oh, he's blitzing with block. Oh, gets oh the block down. genius. Absolute genius. You'd love to see it. Yeah, there we go. Three. Gosh. Full power. Just a stun. Heartbreaking. Never lucky. Heartbreaking. <laughs> oh, no power. No follow. No. <laughs> so there's an exposed <laughs> um, zombie, isn't there? Like, the, the ghoul's kind of exposed, but it's so far. I think you, you, you just probably try and pick off the zombie as as lame as it is, like you're not excited about doing that, is it? But like that's you hit the zombie if that's all you can hit, you'd much rather be like chlorine a good player, but I think you just gotta go for the <laughs> off. Yeah. Yeah. Fuel lists. Yeah. You got claw. Yeah, I like that. Like never too happy about that's all you've got, but it's still at least you're getting a claw hit, you know, like that that's good. Keeping everything in front of you. Getting a claw hit in completely reasonable turn. Three dice a wraith. Mm, very reasonable turn. Cast. Oh, does that stick? He's, he's celebrating like it has done, but it has no. not. No. <laughs> what a dicing. <laughs> the celebration is so goofy, holy shit. <laughs> So you can 3D the zombie here. No, I, I don't need like that. I would have, I would have valued three dice in the uh, three dice in the zombie mode personally. I think, I think he's worried about the mummy getting clawed. Yeah, but two dicing him or three dicing him. Uh. I think he's definitely getting clawed now. Or should be. 
Yeah, but it's the other one that's getting clawed, isn't it? It's not the one that he protected. Do you reckon? Well, he's just going to blitz him through the back, isn't he? Yeah, like this one, yeah. No, no, it's oh, no. this. Yeah, I meant, I meant this one, and then, but you said the other one. But I mean, like, oh, so well, yeah, no, he's protecting yeah, him. He, yeah, he yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought anyway. But there was, he didn't have a he didn't have a he didn't have a fleshy there though, did he? Like that's the thing, he didn't have the fleshy to get the pushes in or anything. Yeah. Whereas he had the fleshy here. Like this was the one under threat because of the fleshy being there. Um What happened there? So the tackle guy. Did he regen? No, it KO. KO. So, oh, somehow there's been two KOs without realising what the hell's happening because Blood Bowl 3 is a little bit hard to tell what's happening at times. <laughs> <laughs> Just quietly. Ball carrier? Yeah, and that's fair enough, right? It's his only block player. Um, he's, he's, just, he's just lost his other two block players. So, you know, unless you're going to 3D this guy um, with a mummy. Then it's a ball carrier blitz. Yeah, beast the beast the wolf. Oh, kind of doing that necessitates this dodge. Yeah. I mean, well, not doing that. Like that. Like that's the thing. It's it kind of you have you have to you have to do one right. What you what he could have done is. He could have uh, could have put this guy here, which you know gets him surfed, um, unless he makes the dodge to protect him. Right, so he could have done. He could have he could have moved there, and then moved that out. Yeah, but at the moment, this is like he left on. It's only a one D, so it, I think it was probably right to do either. Honestly, like do you know what I mean? Like could have probably just not even based him. Could have just put him there. And it would have probably been enough because the, the, this one double G if I one D, it's not really, not really. Uh, right. Yeah. Yeah. I I, w I wouldn't mind someone double G if I into one D me looking for a pal. So. Yeah, and on the two they get served, right? Yeah. Well, even on the push they get served probably. Yeah. But you know, if if this guy was closer, <laughs> then the correct play would have been, I think, to cover the back and then do the ghoul, so that you would definitely go around the back. And if you get a zombie surface, not so bad. But with this one being so far away, oh wow. Um. Okay, I mean, there's no, an assist right there. <laughs> there's an assist right here. <laughs> that was mad. I didn't. Where was the wolf? I didn't even see that wolf coming in. He was on the floor. He was the guy who got wrestled. The ghoul wrestled him oh, last yeah. time. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, so I dev now really like not covering the back at all. Yeah. But that was something else, wasn't it? <laughs> and then dead. Yeah. <laughs> 1D pound of death. No regen. Never lucky. Literally a six plus. <laughs> <laughs> and then this guy just comes in to get surfed. Oh, you? man. 1D pound. This is incredible. <laughs> it's certainly something. What turn is it? It's turn... Turn seven. seven. Yeah, this is the thing, isn't it? It's like, do you surf, do you score? I mean, you just do both. It's ball carrier surf, isn't it? Oh, what blitz and then score, yeah. Mm -hmm. The GF one? I'm not so And they've only got a one turn back. So yeah, score for the kill rolls, yeah. Because he's got two he's got two two right turn. And he's, he's only oh, yeah. and, and it's not like the easiest to And it's not the easiest stall, yeah. So you can't stall and he's only got a one turn back, so yeah, score there was Oh, didn't get the KOs back. <laughs> Nobody did, to be fair. So he had two bench right, so he's on ten, yeah? Ten, yeah. Yeah. And the Necro only have one bench. So Oh no, but the Necro killed a ghoul. Oh, so they get an extra zombie, yeah. Yeah. That's so, so annoying. 11.
And then, like, undead can't get ghouls against uh, uh, zombies against necro, can they? Because they've all got regen. No, they've, they've got they've got ghouls as well. Ghouls have regen. Uh, oh, oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh my god, so if you kill a ghoul then you get a zombie, right? But yes. nobody else, yeah. This should have been the hand, I think, and that's where I should... Oh no, okay, you can go further around, yeah. If he scores this one turn, that would be amazing. Oh, he threw it, oh my god. Yeah, like he hasn't got... He's, sc he's scoring an own goal! <laughs> 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 That was class. <laughs> 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 and then just double scum. <laughs> oh man. That was class. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this, I'm off. <laughs> oh, man. So the the tackle stays out. Okay, oh my god, that, that, like, accelerated straight to the kick, what the hell, that's so weird, isn't it, they just skip the, skip the setups instantly, so we've got cups for the necro, and then, uh, and the similar kind of, similar kind of, this is like the, uh, lizard man offense almost, right, this is like the lizard man offense, if you have these both, like, one up, and these three yeah. all one up, and these two both one up, that's the lizard man offense to complete safety against a blitz which this is still like you know this is still pretty safe against a blitz but obviously lizard men aren't really scared of people facing the saurus so they can put the saurus on the los and uh and obviously protect the skins a bit more but uh yeah yeah basically lizard man defense and still 11 players but down yes. on quality with a guard yeah. light and the uh ghoul wrestle ghoul so big big quality miss for the uh undead Annoyingly, gets the uh, both down, which means it's two dice. Yeah. 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 <laughs> this is this is looking really tough for undead because it's they've just got zombies. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Zombies aren't good, are they? As much as zombies are good for like getting punched. Uh, if if you're asking to win the game with them, it's not good, is it? Okay, at least the ball so didn't what? scatter. <coughs> the crowd. But, yeah, so he's got three goals. Three goals. Yeah, it's not terrible. <laughs> yes, girl. In fact, they look so much like them that Triple Skull put one on the LOS on defense. <laughs> completely, completely reasonable. It's crazy. You got three, right? Sneaky. Three ghouls. These yeah, uh, the rookie ghoul, block ghoul, yeah. and sneaky. The, the rest of one's dead, right? Wrestle one's dead. Well, this is the wrestle one, probably. <laughs> oh my god, uphill. I like it. Honestly, I like uphilling mummies. Not, not to go there, <laughs> but to go away. You know. Yeah. So the so that they don't punch you with mighty blow like it up uphilling big guys is way better now when their it's, mighty yeah, blow gets turned off. Yeah, that's it. And people, like, I forget, I forget that a lot actually. Mm. And then you've got the random chance of actually hitting them as well. Yeah, yeah. Like, I mean, he didn't take the ball down there, did he? he? Just took the push. <laughs> didn't want to just randomly get cast, which can happen. Yeah, it definitely can. Yeah, these these two round here is pretty scary. Also, the blockless blocks. I mean, four rerolls is a lot. Yeah, lots of pushes. Wow, fantastic, fantastic gym dice here. <laughs> oh, oh, that mummy! I think we're clawing that mummy, right? Yes. Yeah, we should be clawing this mummy. Yeah, this this mummy probably had to stay here. To protect that mummy. If if this mummy stays here, you can't claw it, right? Oh no, you can claw it from behind. Yeah. Yeah. So there's no real way to protect them. You you you're getting clawed. You're getting clawed one way or the other, because this this one comes in from behind if you stay there, and if you move back, then you claw this one in the front. Um. 
it, like from here, right? You, for this one you claw from here because you put a you put a fleshy. This fleshy blocks and follows. Yeah, and then well, you, you take the you block yeah, takes the wraith hit first, then the fleshy hit, and then yeah, yeah, yeah. The zombie steps across. Yeah, and so so you're blitzing this one from here for your claw hit, and then if you just need a push, and then you it's in the three, it's six dice, so that, so that's easy. And then if you but if you stay there, that would have stopped. But then if you stay here, then he just puts in a fleshy there and two other players, and you know a, a ghoul in the, the back. On the, he has to put the wraith on the mummy though, right? Sense. Um, no, if if you're here, if if, if yeah, this yeah, mummy's if here, you put yeah. in three players there, right? Yeah, and then you Which put the ghoul the and, and the two zombies. Th yeah, and then you put the and ghoul you... in there to assist as well. All right, and then you blitz him from the back with this wolf. Yeah, yeah, okay. So yeah. you don't have to put the wraith on the mummy. No, but... no. So so either way, you're just getting you're getting your mummy clawed. There's no there was no way to defend them. Look, it looked like a mistake at first because it's exposing him to this, but he's not doing it. I, well, I guess... Oh, he, could, he could come in from the back with this, but he's not. But he should, I mean, he should have oh. definitely clawed the wraith. Like, you, you've got to claw the mummies. Every chance you get, you've got to, you know, use your use your stand firms uh, to claw mummies, I think. That's what I think, anyway. And I think oh. you've got to do everything to avoid that as the as the uh, undead coach. But none of that happened. <laughs> yeah, mad. I can't believe you didn't call a mummy. Yeah. Is it wandering Ooh. around now? I don't know about moving backwards with the mummy. Now it's it's not it's not what you want, but again you 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 know it's you do <laughs> one of them's getting clawed. If he wants to claw them now, he's unfortunately he's just going to claw them, isn't he? There's nothing you can really do about it. Oh yeah, yeah. But I meant I would have just stayed on the halfway line and put my cage like put, I would have brought my cage to the mummy, not my mummy to the cage. Yeah, so. yeah, could have done. Could have done. I I don't like hate it right because you've got plenty of time. You've got to score yeah, yeah, yeah. haven't you? But yeah, I, I know what you mean. Which is because they have stand firm and they have side steps. So like every time you go backwards, they move up, and then it's even harder for you to get back up, right? It's yeah. Just like, you want to hold the line, like you don't want to. Yeah, I, would have, I mean, yeah, I would have definitely want to hold the line as well. Yeah. Maybe he's scared about the, this fleshy coming in and stuff, yeah. so I wanted wanted more chance to hit it. If but it I mean, fall. he's kind of he's kind of got away with it because he didn't move to Gollum all the way. No. <laughs> Rundy. Oh my god. I mean, <laughs> he's got a 2D here, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah. Like, he literally moved in the assist to make this. Oh no, because yeah. he, he understood up. Okay, so he's got a blitz. Okay, so no, th this isn't too bad. This yeah, isn't too bad. Fine. It's fine. Yeah. yeah, it wasn't as bad as I thought. I wouldn't say it's fine, because I would have tried to have done, you know, something I'm better. Thinking. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's the stun on the tackle as well. I mean, it just seems better to fucking smash the fuck out of a mummy. Honestly, <laughs> that's what I'm doing. This mo this wolf here yeah. is smashing this mummy here and and clawing it and then you know fouling it if you want. Then undead with one mummy is shit. Like, the, look, he had his whole team in front of him. <laughs> but yeah, if you, even if you are going to do that, yeah, then you do, then you 1D the... So yeah, so, so sorry, so to, to answer Squirrel, it, it's still correct to do the to do the ghoul 1D first, right? Because the ghoul 1D is a 2 plus, and then that gives you the wolf 2 into 2, which is just way better, right? So like, it was still yeah. wrong because the, 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 the undead is a 2 plus that knocks him down 50%. Whereas the the wolf was just looking for a five plus twice, so he had two chances of sculling, and also the bolt down, you know, did nothing. So he had a one in six to do nothing, one in six to skull, and it was just terrible. Whereas the the girl would have at least got the zombie off on a two plus to give you the two and a two, to, you know, knock down with claw. So it was definitely wrong to do the ordering. Um, even after you've chosen that line of play, the ordering is wrong.
But actually, having these two goofs behind the line, <laughs> these two random players just going, hello, um, it's actually pretty good, isn't it? Because, uh, you know, it's look how much, look how far back he's gone, as you said. Like, yeah. all these, he's got hardly anything up front. He's diverted so many resources to deal with these guys behind his, behind his ball. He's got I'm nothing guessing, in front of his ball. I'm guessing there's going to be a stand firmer and a side stepper on the ball this time. Oh, just a friend. Or maybe not. Oh no, it's got over. It didn't oh, take didn't the ball down. down. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. <coughs> okay. It's not what I would have done. So no, that could have been a stand firmer and a Rafe as well. Oh no, there's only around the back blocks it, but yeah. yeah. I would have blitzed like from the sides towards the mummy. I just then... blitzed mummies constantly. I just been constantly yeah. smashing mummies here. Like this is this is your dream as a necro is that like you 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 know you're in a dominant position. You just get to tee off on mummies. Like this is how you win yeah. the game. Yeah. True. I mean, you felt the difference, didn't you, against Andy, right? You were like three players up, and and it looks brilliant. Then he removes the mummy, and you're like, fuck, I've got a score now. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like, exactly. Yeah. It's ridiculous how, how big a mummy is. Oh, ball carrier dodge. Absolute lack of penetration here. Basically giving up at this point in the undead, almost. Where are we? What turn? 13. Turn, turn, yeah, turn 5 of the drive. Uh, it's alright, it's alright. Oh. I would have liked to have put someone up. It's not alright, is it? I mean, it's, <laughs> it's turn five and you're quite far in your own half. It, it might be alright, like it, it can be turned around. But right now, it's, uh, you, you, you know, you need the breakthrough. And like a screen, it's... Oh my, oh. Oh my god, dub skulls. There you go, Jim. It was all fine all along. Yeah, I mean, th this wolf that just wandered over here <laughs> could have smashed the fuck out of a mummy on his way. <laughs> on two dice! <laughs> but, yep. So now, now it is looking pretty good, yeah, because now... It's the... looking amazing now, yeah. yeah. It's looking yeah. like GG for the undead, so... Yeah. Uh, yeah, the problem is this wolf, because you know he's just going to surf. You know he's just going to uphill, uphill surf it. <laughs> 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 it's not. It's still not looking great, is he? he hasn't got many players. Like it, this is all. This is all pretty. Like you know, these these three guys are just oh my abandoned. God. Jesus. Yeah, these three guys are completely abandoned. I know it's three on three, but like it's, you know, if the if the player quality up front gets, oh, yeah, pow. go pow. Oh, pushed him away from the guard. It's a tenuous. I'd say it's tenuous for the for the undead at the moment. It's not looking amazing. It's, it's looking pretty good. It's looking. I mean, it, it's looking a lot better now. Yeah. Yeah, now, now it looks amazing. Yeah. Like we just blitz off the wolf. Yeah, the and then we've got three guys free, and you make an L shape, right, further down. Easy. Yeah, so you can move this guy first, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, and then you're safe and you've won. Basically. Why didn't he just go past? I don't. I don't get this. Eh? <laughs> I would have, like. I, I'm, I would have been here with a guy there and a guy out there. Oh right, yeah. Dead, dead, dead. Dead, dead, dead. Because you you want to be dead, like dead. further away so they can't get in front of you, don't you? Is the problem. Because the moment uh, this could be like the 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 flesh you could like double GFI and power and then the wolf can run all the way around in front of you. Whereas if you're two squares further oh, forward, they're blitzing from behind you and they're just standing behind you. Or like 
abreast of you. Oh my god, dub skulls. Quad skulls. Quad Hang on, skulls. What term is that? This is turn 15. That was turn 15 for Triple Skull, and then the la it was like the last action Dub Skull. Oh, okay. So this was, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought this was like the start of the next turn for a second. Eh? No, no. They finally knocked over a mummy. Yeah, I should not have rerolled, right? On the off chance of it being, of it being, uh. Oh, now he's got the Wraith free, yeah. Yeah, but I still think just don't reroll on the off chance of overtime. Square again. Yeah, see now he's gone back he's got in front, hasn't he? Yeah, well he's had to dodge. And now oh my god. Okay, maybe, maybe he did have to reroll this because <laughs> this is right. They finally knocked over a mummy, yeah. Yeah, now it's not easy, is it? So those two extra squares would have made a big difference, I think. Oh, it's got to be the uphill blitz on the wolf, right? Dodge 1D? What, 4 plus? Oh, right, yeah, dodge 1D. Ugh. And 4 free me. Ugh. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah, so not looking that amazing in the end. I mean, that, that quad skull is into complete surrounding from... <laughs> used up all the rerolls of the necro, but he, he got his he got his four players in, didn't he? He took the pile. Yeah. He can't score, can he? No. Oh, no, he can. No, he can. No, he's not. He can't now. <laughs> 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 can can wolves score? Uh, can wolves pass? Yeah, they got PA4 yeah, plus. They could have just lobbed it. it. Oh man. Alright, you might as well. Triple skull ain't got a turn. Mm. Yeah, fair enough. Triple skull, fair enough. Like it's it's hard, isn't it? The uh, the the UI and everything and it's The UI is horrendous. I, I once um rage quit a game because I couldn't figure out how to use the chainsaw. Yeah. I couldn't figure out how to throw teammate for ages as well. Oh my god, I've got a video on my YouTube. It, take, it takes me, Lupak, and Moridam like about fucking 10 minutes to be able to throw a teammate. You've got like two <laughs> people with a combined 20,000 hours, and you've got Moridam who's like all of his hours are with goblins, and we just couldn't fucking do it. <laughs> <laughs> it was ludicrous. <laughs> Right, so, wait. Okay, they, they were just set up like this already, right? So it was the uh, the Necro won the toss. Right, okay. And then and then the Necro won the toss in overtime. The guard has now failed three KO rolls, but the Undead have got 11 players, and the Necro got 11 players. The Necro are down a little bit of quality with a ghoul, and... And the under the down, yeah, the guard white is pretty, pretty huge, and and, and you know the wrestle girl's big as well, isn't it? No rerolls for the neck roll. Oh no, he got he got an extra one. He got a reroll from the kickoff. Huge. Oh, I hate that. Oh my god. Yeah, I do as well. It's so tilting. He shouldn't have the when they inevitably use it on like the crucial game losing block. You know, like, he shouldn't have this reroll. <laughs> <laughs> it's guaranteed. It's guaranteed. Yeah, and a touchback. Yeah. Oh, he's got the balls. Yeah. He hasn't clawed a single mummy this game, has he? No. And he's had so many opportunities in the second half. And then Frenzy trapped himself there. <laughs> oh, he, he loves the uh, scoring threat, doesn't he? Yeah. Uh, this is... Okay, right. So I was going to say, this is just hittable. <laughs> but yeah, okay, moving around. Saves him. Yeah, not, not the best wolf usage I've ever seen in my life. Is Yeah. If you're watching Chaos Cop, 
You need to claw the mummies. Claw the mummies. Use use the guards. Don't tell him this. Don't tell him, <laughs> tell him after the competition. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, dear me. Um, yeah, use the fleshies. So you know you push into fleshies so it doesn't move, and then push it in again. So like you know you don't get yourself into trouble with frenzy traps. And then obviously it's guards cool. and yeah, sorry, Dimmy. Hmm. <laughs> 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 yeah, the and the beater. Like like here, right? Here is another is another one. Um he could have just brought in another player to like hit there first, but again, right, if he blocks there he can he can go what one, two, three. Oh, it'd have been a GFI, so maybe not this turn here. Eh? But you could even GFI, right? Just to just to get the two, like just to get a mummy hit. You could GFI, not when you've got one reroll. But yeah, you know, there are times when you would do that GFI to to get. Well, you could run around. You could hit him from the back. You could put the fleshy in here and go one, two, three, four, five, six, right, and hit him in the back. So you could have called the mummy again. Yep. There was another mummy clawing turn <laughs> available. So yeah, f fleshy in here, and then run all the way around to hit him. Did he blitz yet? No, I don't, he just didn't blitz. So yeah, it's all about the It's all about, I mean, oh my. Oh. God. <laughs> and then pushed him the wrong way, you know? It's the only way you could push him. Just oh, have blocked I didn't him. see the stun body. I yeah, didn't see just shouldn't him. have blocked him. And didn't blitz and could have, could have clawed the mummy. A blockless block. A blockless block. <laughs> Obviously, because there's nobody with block that can blitz. <laughs> but, you know, <laughs> that's, never, that's never stopped out before. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> That's nice, you've got the me, me dominating the fleshy now. Dodging away an extra assist. No. Marking you, marking you. Ooh, school's back. But yeah, gotta conserve the rerolls. I love this stupid flesh golem headbutt. <laughs> it's terrible, isn't it? <laughs> like, it's so bad, it's good. Oh my god, 1D. Instant pow. Bosh. And a removal. And a dodge. Oh my god. And a dodge with just basically instant two dice on the ball if it failed. Is he throwing a pass here? No. He is. Oh, oh my, my god, he really god. did it as well! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Let <laughs> 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 me. Oh my god. I mean, this is this is pretty good. I mean, he's got two tackle zones on it, but if he fails this dodge, like there's not there's nothing to do except dodges. Oh no, he can GFI with the uh... so he could GFI with a zombie here, right? Because it would be it would be like less safe. The, the hit would be less safe for a turnover, right? But the actual chance of hitting would have been higher because it would have been a one in thirty six to not hit him. Instead of right. one in nine to not hit him, so so there's a lot to be said for like geifying. Uh, and where where was this sneaky get? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. So so probably there's something to be said for geifying hitting with the uh, zombie. I don't know if it's right or not, but possible. Yeah. And, yeah. Obviously, this should have followed. Yeah. Yeah. I need to be in here. Well. 
GFI is okay, no problem. Good night. Whoever ever said good night, I'll just on the top there. Uh, machine. Machine. Yeah. Fluffy burrito. <laughs> Rage on install BB3. <laughs> That's a good idea. Oh! Cars. The mummies are. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Well, wait, wait, we'll roll it off from the dice log. So, so, I want to see the armor on that. Oh, he would have cast the zombie anyway. Uh, mm. Every time skeletons get hit, I need to know if it was. Weak. <laughs> Mate, I played Undead with my slan, and I buddy, he had skeletons, and two of them stayed on the pitch because of fixed skull, and not because, <laughs> not because of their low AV. <laughs> So I was like rolling 10 and then getting the 8. What a dice What a dice I mean, there's been, so, there's been some dice for the Necro, to be sure. Yeah, with no reroll as well. No oh, man, some Necro, I mean, that was, that Ghoul Dodge was terrifying, wasn't it? I can't believe how much like ghoul dodge is just absolutely terrifying me. Like, I, yeah. if, if I can make a whole game without dodging a ghoul, I'll be very fucking yeah. happy. Yeah, <laughs> mate, honestly, like tabletop, I spend like every turn avoiding dodges, and inevitably I need one dodge in the whole half that, to make it. And not only will they fail it, they'll kill themselves <laughs> when they fail it. Like, it's so heartbreaking. <laughs> And then your opponent is zero rerolls, zero dodge. Let's just succeed everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is a one into two. Wait, you can probably get this. No, he could have GFI. It's probably worth GFI to make it two into a two. Uh, well, maybe not. Okay. He gets a one into a two, only pushes, and then gets to hit with the. Uh, yeah, bring him up and hit him with the. Uh, up here, he should be in here. Here. Oh no, he should be in here because he's gone the wrong way, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. There, this is probably better actually, isn't it? Yeah, I like that square. Yeah. Because I forget that we're behind the necro. <laughs> it's felt more like, uh, I don't know, more. It's felt more. Oh god. Oh. A one in one nine. In nine. Oh my god, both rerolls have gone instantly. What the hell does this guy do? He just ends the turn. I was going to say there wasn't much he could fucking do, was there? Wait, Did he run out of time? Uh, run out of time, maybe. Yeah, run out of time. Yeah. Yeah, fair enough. More UI. More UI uh, struggles. <laughs> this is uphill. <laughs> Oh, I guess the power, so he gets the assist. So again, we've managed to make it a two and a one. So yeah, set up your frenzy oh hits, God. Chaos Cop. You have to set up your frenzy hits, so it's like two and a two if you possibly can. Like this was. This was like incredibly greedy, right? Not to move this guy. Yeah. Okay, he's, he is the recovery, but just make it two and a two, you know? He's still in range. Yeah, just about. Just about. Hmm. That cow. pass, that pass. <laughs> it's incredible. <laughs> <laughs> no rerolls, just yellow. One day, in two. Come here. Again, this could have been a 2D first, right? Was, uh, like this, this wolf could have come in there and he could have 2 d this. Yeah. And then the, the zombie could have come there, made it a 2D on the ball. And then you could have also dodged this guy first, 
to then like you know so you get the zombie in front yeah, of some kind of defense one. yeah two into two yeah. yeah and then and then try this dodge off so it's two into two yeah so definitely would say to try to do that or, or even even like kind of greedier but better would have been for this guy to block first like stand this you don't even need to stand him up do you but stand him up this if this fleshy powers the mummy then this zombie can go one two three four for the assist and then you've got the wolf free as well so yeah like the the yeah. damn wolf would have also been free so it could have and yeah this guy's come here eventually and i get that you don't want to make a one in nine risk before you make the block but if it's making it two and a two you kind of got to haven't you got to prioritize making Dutch. improving no, your uh, when you don't get the power on the mummy, I think you dodge that wave. Yeah, maybe. Uh, oh! One deep arm. Dirt back. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute dirt back. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is a bit of a pickle. It is. It's just it's got, got a one deep blitz. Yeah, one deep blitz the zombie. Uh. I don't know. I don't know. Is it? Is it not a? Is it not a GFI? Is it not a mummy GFI? Because then on a push, you can like double dodge. Whereas oh yeah, this is a push. Three, three. Mm, if this is a push, you But then you're down. doing a two plus. You're doing a two. You plus. are doing a two plus, but this is a two plus, isn't it? But then you got the four three with reroll. Yeah. Whereas if you fail the two plus, it's just over, right? Yeah, but if you this is a two plus as well, Dimmy. This the the one D blitz is a two plus, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think I maybe the, I think maybe the mummy GFI is better. You got two plus into like one in nine, or a two plus into the seventy five percent one in nine, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But like the thing is, if you pow on a if you if you've if you if you five or a six this first hit, then you just yeah, and you've got nice. no yeah. But if you if you three or four or two it, they're all like if you if you're all the two, it's bad as well, isn't it? So well, if you two, then you've just got the four three. If you two, then yeah, you four three there, yeah, which is bad, isn't it? Or four, on a four well, three, four, three, three God, I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I went the wrong way. In fact, you could jump on a you just jump. <laughs> oh no, you don't because you haven't got no, no, you haven't got dodge. We well, haven't got rerolls, yeah. Like if you have a reroll, the the jump is better, isn't it? Because you could put in a team reroll, but yeah, you'd have to fall through it. Yeah, yeah, think. but you, yeah. I I think this is all right. Yeah. It's all right, but I think I think okay. the I think I prefer the GFI. The mummies are two dots. Hmm. Plus, then, like you're powering the like if you power, you're also powering the the wolf. The wolf, the one that's gonna catch her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. One nil to dead skillful. Oh no, it's no, the it's chaos cop. It, it, the the icon is the is the real one. <laughs> the icon is the real one. So yeah. triple. Oh, it's okay. So tr triple skulls one on the left. Yes. There's like way more draws on these dice than there are in real life. <laughs> three two. Why is it always three two? I don't know. Maybe, or maybe they do first to three. No, because it was two two, and then they did an extra two. So this time it actually stopped. And this time it actually was sudden death, right. right? They they went. It was it was two two after five, and then there was a draw, and then somebody won. But the other one, there was like four extra ones after the five. I, I've got no idea what's happening with the with the things. So yeah, so basically, what happens is the icons are correct, and the team names are swapped <laughs> for no reason. Um, yeah, <laughs> congratulated you with the win. Yeah. Also, probably for your opponent, Triple Skull, this is the craziest thing. Like for for watching here. This matches up with um, which side wins, right? For us watching, 
the the necro logos over here and stuff so it matches up so it looks like this side has won but from his screen it looks like you've won and it looks like the logos are wrong and it looks like he's lost it's so it's so it's so incredibly bad hopefully they'll fix it before the world cup so that you know people will have a clue what's happening when it goes to kicks <laughs> it's so funny i still don't know who won the game last night both screens says you won oh my goodness it at what? least it said uh at least it said in the other one um it actually did say that the other guy had lost yeah he lost but you see you see the celebration of the team that won right on the mm. final if you, screen if you're paying attention yeah <laughs> and uh hopefully for fabrio hopefully um so yeah that's uh well i mean so i will be casting all of the world cup games in until the 6th of december and then hopefully i'm going to france again um, you know the same the same as last year um so yeah, it's the 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 kicks are pretty fucked up, but uh, hopefully you know they'll sort it out. Um, I don't know. Hopefully, like yeah, I'll I'll message them and <laughs> say, will it be fixed before the World Cup? Because sure, like hopefully they know the extent of all the things that are wrong, right? Because, but anyway, yeah, it it was definitely Chaos Cup that won because it's the it's the the logos are correct on this screen, um, and yeah. Again, you just it doesn't take the post-match screen. Oh no, it doesn't if you're live, it does on the replays. And yeah, there you go, NAF Cup Necros plus money win the game. So congratulations to Chaos Cop, commiserations to Triple Skull. That was... Uh, yeah, that was a game and a half. It was, yeah, flip me. Uh, literally, <laughs> a game and a half. <laughs> yeah, yeah, literally. <laughs> Loads of OTs in this in this tournament, isn't it? It's been. I think it's every single one except for one. I think, yeah. I think. and that was tonight, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. We've, we've done nine of them as well. It's wild. Loads of OT. Um, so there you go. Um, thanks, thanks, Dimmy. Brilliant having you in the thanks. booth as always. Thanks, Jimmy. And thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.